analogy somehow between between chant and uh, bow ties in the following sense that both of them can be easily described uh, a chant you just look at the notes on the page and sing them what's the big deal it's the same thing with a bow tie a, a tie and a bow tie is no different from tying a shoe in fact in all of its mechanics uh, nonetheless it requires some practice and uh, intensive practice sometimes so we'll just call this the bow tie intensive and we'll make it very short okay uh, the bow tie goes like this Actually, let me lower my camera down here so you can see exactly what I'm doing. Uh, so, we begin with the left side a little bit longer than the right. Maybe something like three quarters of an inch. And I always remember that because left, longer, left, longer, they both begin with L. That's my trick. I know it's a complicated trick uh, um, and, and it would never occur to you to think of that yourself. But anyway, so left longer and it's about three quarters of an inch longer. Now we put the left over the right hand side, just like that. And uh, then the one side that's over comes up through. And that's it. Uh, something of a little finger trick that you pick up uh, after years of experience. Okay, now we're left with this and you want to kind of shove it up high on the shirt, right above the button really, because otherwise your bow tie will be saggy and, and uh, not look right. So that's it. Now you start to make the bow tie shape. So this is what you have. You start making the bow tie shape with the lower part of the bow tie and pull that over to the right and kind of make it look like what you imagine a bow tie would look like if it were actually tied. So you end up with something like this. Let's see if I can move my hand the other way. There, yeah. Uh, you end up with that. So let me just try that again. So you just pull that over and make a little bow tie shape. And that's it. Okay. Uh, and then the top part is standing over the, th the, the top there and you pull it underneath and stick it through and this is the part that's a little bit strange. You stick it through a hole that doesn't yet exist. It's kind of like the ictus in some way. You think it doesn't exist and then it does exist suddenly once you observe it. So I observe the hole and then that's pretty much it, believe it or not. The rest is just a matter of straightening. Uh, and then you can start kind of making a little shapes and uh, you find your own personality and sense of, of whatever there. And that's, that's the whole bow tie. So let's just try it again real quick. So that would be kind of a refresher. Left side a little longer, left side over the right side, up through, pull it up through, get it up high on the collar, pull it and make it in the shape of a bow tie, find the ictus and through the hole and the bow tie is done. And that's my seminar on the bow tie done especially for done especially for the the chant intensive conference uh, i hope you all have a great time i wish i could be with you um thanks bye